Hello, we're doing a leaf study today, my girls and I. It's October and it feels beautiful outside. It says live within your harvest. And I just put a few leaves here. I don't have any from outside, but this is just to show you. And we're going to read three books. The Very Hungry Caterpillar, he eats his way through leaf. Um, my little golden book about God. It's more of a springtime book, but it talks about leaves and has, it's just a good little book. And then Apple Trouble. And this little hedgehog eats a leaf, or tr tries to get a leaf off of his back. It's a cute little book. So those are the books we're going to read. And then I did, I found this on Pinterest. It's our book cover. It's from, through Crayola. And I thought that was just cute. It gave some variety instead of just one big leaf. This is for my nine-year-old, and I found through, oops, sorry, through Twisty Noodle, you can change the, the leaf um, to be more specific. It can be the only thing on there, so for like a preschooler, you could just do the leaf. Um, I put it in cursive and parts of a leaf, and you'll see for my six-year-old how I changed it for that, too. It's super easy. I thought that was really a great idea. And then I found on Look, We're Learning Year-Round Homeschooling, um, she had a unit on leaves, and I just printed off. She had 15 pages. I printed off two. It's common types of, types of leaves, and I thought, my kids won't find all of these outside, but it's just a good little starting point. And then this is the second page I printed off. It says, match the leaf to its name. I thought that was really cute. And simple. And then I just put, <coughs> excuse me, four blank sheets and I'm going to have them after they color and do all this part, go outside, take their book list outside and find four different leaves, put them in there. We're going to identify them and tape them down. So that's for my nine-year-old. For my six-year-old, same thing on the front, but this was the page that instead of cursive, I just did one word. Now you could do the same amount of words as the other one and do it in printing, cursive, however you want to do it. That was Twisty Noodle. I thought she had a, he or she had a lot of cool stuff. And then again, match the leaf to its name, blah, blah, blah. That rest was the same there. Now for my three-year-old, I she will want something too, so I did this cover page. And then for her leaves, I just gave her one sheet and I made it purple. She'll like that. She can tape her leaves on there, go collect them with her sisters come back and then have her own little workbook. But it's much simpler, not a lot of going around doing a lot of different things that she just wouldn't know how to do. So anyways, hopefully that will give you some good ideas for a leaf study. Thanks for watching, please subscribe.